What do you guys love? What will get you to do anything in the world to set you free? How many hours are you going to put in to make sure that you and your family, your loved ones will be free for the rest of your lives? You know, I came to this conclusion just a few months ago, actually back in February. I came to the decision between whether or not I should continue pursuing the dream of uh, what I graduated college for. Like, I, I went to a university and graduated. And next thing you know, I'm realizing I can make more money and set myself free by setting up a business all on my own. Guys, this is what I wake up for every morning. It's 6 a.m., 7 a.m. I'm hyped. I get on my phone. I reply to messages for people. I'm helping people out. And guys, what is it that I'd love? Right now, it's helping other people. And it's building my business while helping other people, guys. This is what is awesome. I cannot stop talking about it. <clears throat> okay? Everywhere I go, when I start bringing up what I love to do, my automatic passion and passion for this business, Amazon FBA and helping others and growing a YouTube channel, all these different things is coming to collide and it's making me fulfilled, guys. I wake up, I know where I'm going. I know the path laid out in front of me. I want you guys to think, what do you love? Ask yourself, not what you hate, but what do you love? What are you going to go do sitting in traffic, standing out in the middle of traffic, ready to get hit by a car? What's going to get you to do what you need to do in life, guys? Think about it because once your why is set, you will know the path you need to go. If you uh, imagine a giant two buildings here and a little tightrope that you have to walk across, imagine uh, you're a million dollars on the other side. Are you going to walk across that skinny type rope to get that money over there? Maybe, maybe not. Imagine if that other building is on fire and your loved one or child is over there. Are you going to run over and get him? You bet so. Because this why, the why that you're about to do that for is different. If someone's telling you to go walk across that type rope just for fun, there's no way you're going to do it. But if your why is that you have a loved one over there, you're going to do it. I'm telling you guys, building small habits every day and working towards your why and what you're doing that you love is going to build momentum for you guys, guys. One moment here. This book, The Compound Effect, it's talking all about building momentum. And after you get that momentum built, it's like a merry-go-round. Once, once that wheel is spinning, it's hard to stop it. So you got to work for that ground floor. When you start with zero subscribers on YouTube, you got to work for it. After time, you're going to start coming up and uh, the momentum is just going to jumpstart your life, guys. Like, I mean, it's it's unbelievable. And I just opened open to this page right here. It's talking about how an airplane just one degree off course is going to, if you're on a flight to New York City, if you're one degree off and you keep following on that path, you're going to end up in Delaware, okay? So a whole couple few states off just because you're one degree off guys this is what i'm talking about if you do partying on the weekend if you drink alcohol and like waste your time that's not helping you succeed so you need to do things that are going to help you succeed follow what you love know that anytime you're not doing what you're needing to do that's going to compromise the fact that you're not going to get to where you want as fast as you want. So I wanted to bring you guys this quick video here. Uh, I mean, look at this, guys. I I mean, I was about to graduate. No, I did graduate with a, with a degree in broadcast journalism. And I mean, it's nice to have a college degree to have uh, if you need to fall back on stuff. But I realized what is what I want? What is the fulfilling thing in my life? It's not to wake up at 6 a.m. to go read news stories about the latest car accident or all the fear and hype that's on the news, guys. It's about helping others realize what their potential is to get them to start their own business. And when I can help others start their own business to make money for themselves, that's the hole in one right there. Because going out and winning the lottery, that's not really even that fulfilling. You win it and you're like, whoa, excited. But it's not like you worked for it. The money doesn't mean anything to you. And it's not something that you can keep regenerating day after day after day. 
So we need to set you guys up with what you can do to succeed. I started doing Amazon FBA, made one simple review video on the Tanner Fox Amazon course. After that, I realized, hey, someone actually watched my video. After that, I started getting more views and more likes on my videos. It started me to now make videos almost every other day. So this is what I feel like you guys can do. Start a little course, do one experience in something, and share it with others. Don't be afraid to get on camera and just bust it out, guys. I know you guys can do this. So if you guys have any comments, leave them down below. It's Friday. Make this weekend a good one, study up, watch some other videos, and you guys are going to be well on your way to discovering what you love and what your why is. Your why will change all over your life. Right now I'm 24. My why right now is basically I want to move out, I want to be on my own, I want to be self-sustained. Later on it's going to be I want to provide for my family, I want to support my kids going to their college or help them follow their dreams. The whys will always change. Figure out what yours is and take a nice little blowtorch and weld the door shut behind you and you follow, you go forward with that why, guys. All right, I hope this was a little motivation for you guys. Thanks a lot for watching the video. If you haven't already, please subscribe. It's your boy, Luke Weschelberger. We're gonna say peace out for this one. Talk to you very soon, guys. See you later. Peace out.